Hello and welcome to Teen Topics, where we'll be learning about energy and the effects it has on Earth. So energy is used around the world for everything we do, from powering vehicles to heating your house. But where does this energy come from? How do we get power to our houses? Well, these are the ways us humans create energy. So let's start with the renewable source of energy. Renewable energy is basically using nature to create power. So starting with solar, this gathers energy from the sun, converting that into electricity. There is also wind power, where turbines have blades that are spun round by the wind. This again gives us energy. There is tidal power, which uses the natural wave energy and the tides to our advantage, but also a hydroelectric power, using dams to push water through turbines, again converting that into energy. These are the most nature-friendly ways of producing our own power. They do not directly damage us or our planet, which unfortunately is quite the opposite to what happens with non-renewable sources of energy, known as fossil fuels and nuclear power. Fossil fuels are when organic matter buried under sediment over millions of years in anaerobic conditions, meaning without oxygen, is changed by heat and pressure into coal, oil and gas. Mining and burying these fossil fuels are destroying our natural resources to make power. This fuel is also distributed all over the globe to heat our homes and give us power. One day we will run out of these resources and before we know it. In fact, it will be about 50 years until we run out of oil, 70 years before we run out of natural gas, and 250 years before we run out of coal. This may seem like a long time, but Geologically, this is a very small amount of time left, and we need to change this. Not only that, we are also destroying our environment. You're probably wondering why we can't get back the natural resources if it is produced naturally. Well, that is because these resources, like coal, take millions of years to create, yet only months to extract. Once it's gone, it's gone. Nuclear power is where uranium is extracted from the ground and uses in power stations to make electricity. The only difference between producing electricity via fossil fuels and nuclear power stations is that fossil fuels can be burned, which directly affects the atmosphere, but nuclear power is splitting the atoms, which seems better for the environment. But all the nuclear reactors produce radioactive waste from the uranium once it is exhausted. It has to be buried in glass-like blocks deep underground because it takes hundreds of years to break down and would pollute the land, rivers and oceans if it leaked, causing catastrophic damage to our planet and wildlife. In the UK, the government wants to reduce the carbon dioxide emissions. It also wants to increase the amount of energy which comes out of renewable sources. By 2020, the European Union wants to have 20% of energy coming from the renewable sources. So why are we not reaching our targets? Well. Coal and other sources of energy are easier to mine and produce, so we have not followed up renewable sources of energy enough. It has improved, yes, but we need more of it. 